this is the energy vibration um, reading for the Ophiosa Sun, Moon, Horizon sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. So Ophiosa, whatever the issue and the situation is, I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Ophiosa, this is a year off here. You got to be careful because you're a fire sign person. Go and check out the um, Sagittarius reading. And um, in order to see the extended of this reading, you have to join the channel and you have to choose the super chat because that's where all the year extended and quarterly are going to be by the super chat and the love reading. So if you want to pick up these extended, you have to join the channel and use the super chat. This is a year of uh, the Divine Mother and Father that is coming up. Number 20 is the Divine Mother and Father. It is a positive year. It's a good year for business for you, Ophiosus, if you're ready to do um, business, okay? And uh, what I'm seeing and what is transpiring, uh, we are going to be going deeper and see what is transpiring. So there is a judgment call. Information is going to be coming in in the month of January. This is a water energy. You're vibrating in hair energy. And in January, you're going to be dealing with information that is coming up at you. Okay. So whatever that was transpiring and happening, some information is coming out. In the month of February, I see you're taking it easy. You're connecting with yourself. You're going inwards and you're waiting, waiting, waiting on some information, something to come out. And this is very good because whatever the issue and the situation is, you're definitely waiting um, for this to come out. So it is wonderful. In the month of March, I see you're moving forward. Whatever that was transpiring, I see you take the energy with power and moving forward, moving out of a deceptive situation and moving forward. So what is happening and what is transpiring? I see that in the first three months of the year, I see a lot of um, waiting, waiting, waiting. But as it comes to March, you're pushing forward and you're pulling forward and you're going. March is going to be a powerful month for you because it's supporting the fire energy. Okay. So whatever it is, information is going to be coming in January. We're going to be seeing that in February. You're kind of waiting on something, but when, when it comes to March, you're pushing forward. Then I see the energy of uh, um, someone who might be using their power or people in power that you're waiting on something for you, Ophiosis, but it's definitely going to be coming in. Um, April is going to be a very, very positive month, especially for people who wants to start their business. I'm seeing a new start coming up in April. This is the energy of the year. And I see the energy of the year is going to be pushing you forward, especially in business, pushing you in a positive alignment of energy. And this is going to be good because whatever that is transpiring, this is your first air energy. And it is looking good because it's giving you a new start to move forward. I see you having a love to deal with in the month of June, which is so powerful because you could be going on vacation, meeting someone new, meeting a soulmate, meeting a twin flame. This is wonderful. And I see you're going for it. I see you stand strong and you're going for it. I see this is a positive alignment for the energies. This, whatever the issue is in the situation is, uh, the energy of the lover is here. And whatever is transpiring, I see you really pushing forward and really dealing with a situation. Um, justice is here. I see a balance. There was some deceptiveness with people in power and I see a balance now coming in. Whatever the issue and the situation is and whatever that was transpiring, I see this balance is coming in and whatever that was transpiring, I really see in the third quarter that you're balancing out issues and situation and it could come from people who have used their powers. You're really standing up against this. Secrets are there and whatever is transpiring, there's a lot of secrets that is coming up. But I see you're finding out and realizing what and who and what has been transpiring. Now, um, hair and water in the third quarter that is coming up is just brilliant because what is transpiring is that you're balancing out certain things with people and situation and you're saying no. You're going to be victor victory and you're going to be victorious and successful in the month of September, because whatever that you were trying to balance out in the beginning of this quarter, you're definitely going to be victorious and successful in doing that because you stood your ground and you're like, I'm not accepting any BS. 
and you just want to move forward out of things and I see you being very victorious and successful because there was some secrets with um, some um, secrets um, and the secrets you balance out because you found out and you stand up and you say no you say no to whoever and no to what was transpiring I see a situation with the organization is coming up in the month of October this is earth energy this is going to bring you grounding this is going to ground you because what has transpired I see you that in the month of September you decide to be victorious over a situation and move forward because that is uh, the energy of victory in September and you're moving forward and whatever and whoever stand in your way you guys are just going to be standing up and getting up and said no I, I, I don't accept that so whatever the organization is institutes it is I see you're going to be standing up and saying no I don't accept that and do not try that I see transition that is coming in because there was some secrets that was kept transition is coming in the secrets have come out because I see you go within within you decide to go on a new journey and there was some secret so in the month of November transition is going to be coming up and it's going to be good transition with an organization so whatever that was happening and was deciding you're successful isn't that beautiful you are successful Ophiosa. so I see some of you Ophiosas. Um, there was some deceptive situation that was in an organization and you stood your grounds and you stand up and stood your grounds and here we're seeing the energy of debt coming up because this transition whatever that was going in an organization obviously there was some secrets and deceptiveness that was going in an organization and you stand up and you are successful so there's two successful one in September and one in December these are your fire sign that is coming in so what is happening and transpiring I see that in the month of April it is just going to be fabulous in the month of April it's going to be fabulous the second um, quarter April May and June is just going to be fabulous um, it's about new start with your relationship moving forward as we come to the third quarter I see you dealing with an issue that is going to be balancing out there was a lot of secret but you overcome this and you're victorious overcoming it in September September is going to be one of your good month I see people if you're going to be starting a business started in the month of uh, um, October because it's looking good I see transition and December you're definitely having a success so it is a year of balancing out so whatever that was happening and transpiring it is definitely a year of balancing out situations and whatever the situation is that you were balancing out you're gonna be good balancing out the situation because obviously there was um, some deceptiveness at play okay sorry I'm taking a picture so you guys can see it there was some deceptiveness at play and you caught it in time and you are kind of changing changing situation and things whatever is happening you're kind of changing situations and things and what is transpiring is that you're balancing out things I see you have a strong foundation I see a lot of you have a strong sound foundation I see you're balancing out situation um, it could be a house situation I see transition the end to a situation the end to the secrets uh, transition and the end to the secrets I see that some um, because what fell out here is the tower ooh, the, uh, ophiosis is the tower energy oh yeah and the angman the tower energy and the angman so um, there is the energy of the angman that is coming in so you have um, 3 and 12 coming up 3 and 12 the energy of the hangman I see 3 and 12 coming up I see a transition with a relationship where you will be going forward a transition in a relationship where you will be going forward okay so I see some conflicts I see you're going to be receiving some message or um, some judgment call is coming up on some people where there are some conflicts 
So whatever is happening in January, I see judgment call coming up on a lot of people where there is going to be conflicts between people. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, I see a judgment call is coming up and whatever that was happening and transpiring, this judgment call that was coming up is conflicts between people. And I will say to you, stay out of it and just watch these people have these conflicts. So whatever that was transpiring, I'm seeing conflicts coming up. A judgment call in January is coming up conflicts between people stand out of it i see you or within waiting i see you're protecting your kids whatever the issues is and the situation is i see you're there waiting you're protecting your kids whatever that has been transpiring and happening i see a protection of kids some of you your kids could be in the hospital and i see you are going you're very busy going in and out and making sure that your kid is okay so that is coming up in february but for some of you who does not have kids i see you going within and healing the child within and connecting with yourself trying to find out who are you what direction you're going on wow the energy of the empress the energy of the empress is here ladies and gentlemen this is powerful this is wonderful what is happening and transpiring with the energy of the empress is that we are seeing that you're moving you know it's as if no one can stop you in the month of a uh, march no one can stop you in the month of march because you are striding your way and you are creating for yourself abundancy you're creating for yourself abundancy so whatever that was happening and transpire you're really treading and uh, moving forward and creating abundancy in your life and this is really going to be good so positive alignment of energy whatever the situation is that was transpiring positive alignment of energy really <laughs> you guys caught me this time all right so i see um an institute the organization is going to help you and release you from some deceptiveness that was uh, um, transpiring so um some of you it could be people in powers are going to be releasing you um, people in powers uh, is going to be stepping in and help you out with a situation because they realize that some deceptiveness was going on and they're going to be giving you a start moving forward okay you're definitely going to be giving you a start moving forward oh my god you guys are just just sitting there all right so as we look at uh, um, a situation here some of you were dealing with an issue with an organization you have some regrets but you you think you know I'm standing my grounds I know who I am I'm standing my grounds don't bullshit me okay so whatever that was transpiring I see you with a situation with an organization and you're like no I'm not accepting that and you stood up to something so whatever is transpiring in this organization I see you standing up to the situation I see you're saying no to a situation whatever that is transpiring I see here you have made a decision you stand up you made a decision you're going to be very successful because there was like an organization that is trying to tell you how things work and you're saying like no I'm the client you gotta um, look at this situation and they were doing it because someone there was um, accessing your information and I see people are going to be coming in like people up a boss um, people at the top is going to be coming in and release this situation so whatever that was transpiring I see you make a decision and the decision that you make was very good very good the decision you make was extremely good that was the best thing and this is why sometimes I say to people you know don't get on the telephone with these customer service because most of them are not properly trained these people are totally ridiculous um, most of them are not properly trained and sometimes you are so pissed off um, because these people um, they're rude uh, for one and they have no idea what is customer service so sometimes it is just better for you to just resolve the situation yourself and I see some of you are just going to be resolving situation yourself and um, definitely I see a new start is going to be coming in with your financials um, situation whatever the issue and the situation is I see a new start coming up for your financial situation so that is going to be happening in March 2020 
All right, um, Opiosis, remember that in order to receive the extended of this reading, you have to use the link to join either this one or this one. Subscribe, notificate yourself. This is a general reading, so this is going to be over. But for the extended reading, then you have to um, join to see what was going on, okay? All right, so let's see. There is um, a judgment call, and a judgment called peace comes. So there was a judgment call with a judgment call peace comes. So whatever the conflicts is or was, I see peace is here. So there was a judgment call and there was conflicts in January and then peace is going to be coming in. Okay. So after this conflicts, I see peace is coming in. Okay. Now in February, the energy of the hangman and you're dealing with some people that is using their powers. Okay. And uh, you're like, um, really? I don't think so. Okay. I am the boss of my own self. So whoever these people and whatever they were doing, these people were using their powers and you were like, hell no. Okay. So, you know, it's not happening. So I see you go within and then you think, okay, this is the way to resolve the situation. I see some of you have been fighting with, uh, it's going to be fighting with a situation in February. And you're going to be standing up and said, I'm the boss of myself, no one else. Okay. And you're right. Whatever is transpiring, you're right. As we move on in March, I see, <laughs> I see you stood up. Whatever you stood up to is like, people are going to be, okay. All right. Respect. All righty. So in March, I see a new offer of financial abundance is going to be coming in and this is going to be beautiful because whatever that was transpiring i see an 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 offer coming in and i see that um whatever it was i see this offer is going to be giving you prosperity and abundance in your life so this is going to be good as we look at the month of April, I see people in um, power or someone has used their power. So be aware that you're going to have some power struggle in this um, in this year. Uh, definitely, there is going to be some power struggle. Whatever the information is, whatever that is transpiring, I see some power struggle is happening because there are some people that have some secrets that they want to keep and you're like, hell no, I have no time for that, okay? And I see other people are going to be picking you up. Now, I see um, a start and I see the transit. So um, some of you be careful um in the month of may there could be a debt of a child whatever is transpiring and happening uh i see the energy of debt is coming up it's twice debt okay so it could be debt to a child okay um it could be the end for a child i see debt is coming in whatever um you know like if you had an issue or a situation it could be your child it could be and on a child, it could be that your doctor and a child die, but it has to do with a child. It could be the end of a child's contract also, okay? It could be the end of a child contract. As we look at the energy of the lovers in, um, in June, I see some of you are going overseas, whatever that is happening. I see some of you going overseas and I see you're connecting with someone overseas. Okay. Let's um, hope that is not someone abroad is passing away, but I see the energy of the lover and this could be someone overseas. Um, it could be a family member that is going to be passing away for some of you also, but I see some of you going on vacation and meeting the love of your life. Okay. Then I see a message, a message. This is a message of just, um, that is coming. Um, and this message is going to bring some balance in your life. Some of you were waiting for a message. Um, and the message is finally here. This message is a, a message that is going to bring balance in your life. Okay. And that is good secrets. I see a lot of jealousy, but this jealousy and deceptiveness is finally over. Over. <laughs> 
So there was some really deceptive situation that was happening. There was some secrets and some real deceptive situation that was happening. And the tower moment comes down. So there was some, whatever that was transpiring, there was some the real deceptiveness. There was um, a really jealous, horrible person that was harassing some of you. And the tower moment come down on this person. And I see the end to this jealousy and deceptiveness that has been transpired. I see victory and success with a house. I see that some of you, there was some deceptive situation that was going on with a house. And I see you're victorious and successfully coming over this situation. I see you're going to be receiving um, an offer. Whatever this offer is, I see whatever is happening and transpiring this very deceptive jealousy that was going on is the tower moment is here and bringing it but you are going to be buying a house in september so some of you you're going to be victoriously coming over a situation and buying a house in september you're going to be receiving a house some of you someone could be passing away and leaving you a house so whatever is transpiring i'm seeing someone passing away leaving you a house um i see your uh, this house is a distance from you um whoever and whatever is transpired i see this house is a distance from you um some of you are going to be receiving the message in the, the month of uh, um september okay wonderful wonderful news ladies i see you ladies or could be starting a job or starting your home business I see you turn your back on something and you're going in to start your own business ladies I see you standing up to a deceptive situation in a corporation and you have no regrets you just stood up to this and you have no regrets so ladies whatever the issue is and the situation is I see you're just standing up to a situation it was a deceptive situation that has happened with one of your um, as someone at work a deceptive situation and there is a transition for this person at the work because of what they have done because I see that some of you were dealing um, whoever this colleague is uh, um, they are realizing um, that they this person has not resolved the issue and the situation okay and um, they're going to make a decision um, to remove this person. So I see the energy of debt. So there is, for you Ophiosis, there's a lot of debt that is coming up. There's debt of people overseas, there's debt of family, there's debt of kids, there's ending. So in November, some of you, your contract is not going to be extended. I see you overcome a conflict. You're successful with a situation and a conflict that was going on. You are successful in December over as conflicts that was transpiring this is good and this is wonderful ophiosis and you have proudly successfully get over a conflicts and i see the end to a conflicts i definitely see the end to a conflicts and you successfully overcome this situation a sip of coffee oh So whatever the issue is and the situation is uh, and the deceptiveness, I see a lot of debt, but I see transition um, for people going to the spirit world. I see um, transition with issues and situation. I see deceptive situation that was happening. I see relationship overseas. I see the transition with relationship overseas, whatever could be happening. So this sort of a situation is a transpiring. I see balance. It's a year of balance. So we're going to be asking the animal spirit guide what is coming out for the ophiosis. I remember this is a timeless reading. So go back and look at 2019 um, um, timeless reading because this is going to be aligning you with certain energies. Okay. So let's look and see which animal is coming in. Ooh, we have the mouse. Again, deceptiveness is coming up. The energy of the mouse is always deceptiveness. So I see some um, deceptiveness. The mouse is coming up in this year and I see the crocodile. All right. I see deceptiveness and I see the crocodile. Okay. So let's look at this and let's see 
where is this deceptiveness because it is coming up um the crocodile is uh, uh the energy of the mouse is here um the mouse is an earth energy okay so whatever is transpiring the mouse is definitely an earth energy so you're having an earth energy um animal to deal with and this is going to be good so the mouse so detail oriented small-minded nitpicker and nervousness the mouse has an intimidated desire to tend to details it often spends its day fixing preparing organizing and strategizing unfortunately a mouse personality doesn't notice when they have gone too far soon they will begin to have a limited and a, a fearful vision of life and try to control every detail this can be quite painful experience for both the mouse and those around them when the mouse energy is at play setbacks for a moment it may be time to find more um personal pleasure um project to divide in and that is worthwhile okay so organization resourcefulness and preparedness as you are balanced if you're not balanced busy with no purpose and to bring balance in a meaningful project okay so this is the energy that is coming up for the mouse let's look at the energy because the energy about the crocodile is a water energy okay the energy from the crocodile is a water energy so whatever is happening we have the energy from the crocodile and the crocodile is always a water energy so we have hurt and water so the energy of the crocodile is uh, resting slumbering, collecting energies cooling off okay so the crocodile remind us to step back from the external world and turn inwards now it's not the time for decision action and discussion the crocodile mantra is wait <laughs> this doesn't mean that the line um around open life ch challenges will disappear the crocodile is much smarter than that it means intensively withdrawing, gathering our own awareness, observing and building energy, filling up the vital resourcefulness so your next move come from a place of wisdom and power. When in balance, wise, patient and silence, powerhouse, okay? When out of balance, feel stuck, lashing out, okay? Um, so that's the crocodile energy. To bring back balance, rest, and uh, a mantra pause, okay? So you can say mantra to bring back your energies, okay? So let's look at what is uh, coming out for the energies of you, Ophiosis. OMG, the sun, success, success, okay? So... For you guys, success is here. It's beautiful. It's wonderful. Whatever the situation is, I think you're going to be very successful in whatever that desire that you have in this year. You have the energy of the sun. You have the you end the year with the energy of sun, and your overall energy in this year is going to be the energy of the sun because you're balancing situation. You're receiving an offer, and you're balancing out issues and situation. Now. We see some of you are going to be confronted uh, with um, as, uh, people and situation. It's like being confronted that something is happening um, uh, and, 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 and catching someone. So um, there could be a break in in the house and you're confronted uh, by someone in your house. And I would say beat the pulp of that person. OK, so whatever is happening, ladies and gentlemen, I'm telling you, OK, because of deceptiveness someone has broken in my house okay and i never feel safe nowhere okay and i have uh, as um i had to find ways and means to be safe again okay so i'm telling you ladies and gentlemen out there whoever enters your house without um uh whoever enter your house without saying that it doesn't really matter what the grounds the the, the vet 
of um, outside people entering your house is that they have to have your permission once the government is not paying for your house or uh, or any organization or institute say no one should enter your house and I'm telling you this ladies and gentlemen because there are some deceptive people that will do things if there is a situation where someone needs to enter your house and even if people come to your door you don't know these people get your key go outside close your door and speak to them okay especially when you don't know them people are being deceptive and more deceptive and more deceptive when you find out that people break in your house it is something that you can never ever ever get over okay it, it is the hardest thing you never feel safe anywhere so protect yourself because you're going to be confronted by someone and if you come in your house and you you are confronted by someone you make sure that they don't leave that house before the police come okay whatever way you need to do they don't leave the house before the police come so be aware um this is a situation that could happen but make sure you stand up for your rights if it's not their house you didn't rent it from them even if you rent a house from someone they can't come in your house i know i was in florida and people were coming in my apartment and this is what i can't understand if you rent and you're paying so much money why the hell are people coming in and out of your apartment when you're not there one you know it is just don't don't accept it don't accept it ladies and gentlemen so expect people to break in but you're going to get them you're they're going to be caught okay archangel shamuel archangel shamuel is here whatever is transpiring archangel shamuel is here um a new beginnings is coming up for you whatever the issue and the situation is you are going to be successful and a new beginning is going to be coming in so whatever the issue and the situation is you're going to be successful and a new beginning is going to be coming in so this is very very positive so ladies and, and gentlemen please remember in order to pick up the extended reading you have to um, um, join my channel whatever the issue and the situation is join my channel and you have to use the super extended and there you can pick up the extended of this reading alrighty I am saying um, goodbye until the quarter mm -hmm.